Hello friends, this is Jennifer Bateman back again for another Rappahannock Area Community Services for Prevention Services Craft Time. Today we are going to be making um, our very own rainbow fish and this craft was inspired by one of my very, very, very favorite children's books, um, The Rainbow Fish by Marcus Pfister. Um, and I'm going to be incorporating a lot of um, cool things that you can do. Um, some of our crafts that we do on Craft Time, um, you know, it's for older kids. And, and so this craft is more geared towards our younger kiddos and just getting some of these skills that we need to be working on for preschool and kindergarten, those things that we're going to start doing here soon. Um, once we start transitioning um, back into normal routines and things like that. So we're going to be making um, a rainbow fish. We're going to be painting in a very, very, very special way. And I hope that you enjoy it. So I'm going to tilt you guys down so you can see what I'm doing. All right? All right, here we go. All right. So what we're going to do today, we don't need that. What we're going to do today is... We are going to um, paint with pom-poms. Now, it, you're look, probably, mom and dads are probably like, oh, she's going to make them paint with their fingers and it's going to get everywhere. No, 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 no. We're going to work on our gross motor skills and it's going to be great. So, I have a picture of a fish, okay? Um, it's it's a white background. There's nothing on the fish. Um, we need to, Our job is to paint the scales of this fish. Scales of this fish. And I, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some paper in the background so that we don't get paint on the table um and it's easier for us to see so i have four colors on my paint palette i just chose four um red green yellow blue i have four pom-poms four paints four pom-poms four clothes pins so what you're going to do is you're going to have your little pick up the pom-pom with the clothes pin see gross motor skills and they're gonna put it in the paint, right? Smush, smush, smush. Paint's on the pom-pom. And we're gonna make a smush, okay? And that pom-pom is dedicated to that color, okay? So whoop, whoops. Don't let them fall. Smush, smush, smush. There we go. All right, and we're gonna continue until this guy is all nice and painted we want to make sure we get a nice good grip on that that little guy right there okay and so this is a fun activity for your um, preschoolers and your kindergarten age kids older kids can do it too but this one's really geared towards our little littles um just because they they matter to us too so i'm gonna make sure that i have all my colors Everywhere and it's okay if the colors mix. I know some kids don't like that, but it's it, it's interesting. And then you can have conversations about colors and how colors mix together and how they can make new colors and all sorts of things because red and blue together make purple and, you know, different things like that. And red and yellow together make orange. And I think I'll go ahead and make orange right now. Yeah, that'll be fun. All right, and then I need some more yellow over here and over there. So it's just a fun way to do it. You make sure you're covering the whole fish, right? And then if they start going crazy and getting really fast, and that's fine. But we want to make sure you want to keep around his, where his eye would go clean for just a little while because you know me, there's something we got to add right right Boop. Boop. all right so there we go a little bit more yellow a little bit more yellow all right so my fish is pretty much oops needs a little bit there we go there we go Boop. there we go okay my fish's scales are painted all right but he has a smile, but he doesn't have an eyeball. So I have a super big googly eye with a glue dot on the back. And I'm just gonna pop that right there. So now my little guy, it's all painted. 
with an eyeball and a happy face. He's very happy to be painted. And you painted with pom-poms and clothespins and you had a great time and this is so much fun. You don't just have to paint fish. You know what? You don't just have to paint fish. You can paint anything with pom-poms. You can paint, uh, you know, trees and butterflies and birds and all sorts of things. The, the name of the game here is just be inventive. Be, you know, crafty. Be spontaneous. Um, but try, try, um, try to do, you know, crafts that you're used to doing in new ways. That's, that's the name of the game, especially with our little littles. And I hope you guys had fun and definitely go check out the book, um, The Rainbow Fish by Marcus Pfister. I know that RACSB um, Prevention Services um, Storytime has done The Rainbow Fish. Um, and so make sure you check out our um, prevention page, our RACSB um, Community Services page, um, Prevention Storytime. And uh, hopefully you'll see The Rainbow Fish up soon. All right. Thanks so much, guys. Bye-bye.